Hello, Mr. Red here. Today is February 16th, 2018. And Wreck-It Ralph. Wreck-It Ralph is here with us. That's right. Ralph and I, today we're, we're actually um, going to be setting out our uh, swarm traps today. And uh, what, what I've done is, uh, you saw in, in one of our last videos when we did our rotations, we had the, the dead out hives. And, and what we're doing today is we're taking all those dead out hives and we're converting them into swarm traps. And so, like you see, all this, all this frame, this stuff is like beautiful stuff. All we have to do is we got an air hose right here. We're going to blow off some of the stuff. But basically, we're going to clean these boxes up very minimally uh, because we want to keep um, as much of the nasty smells in the box as possible. But uh, other than that, we're going to clean the bottom boards pretty good. But the boxes, we're going to leave them alone. And we're going to actually uh, go out to our sites and set them. Um, and we're, we're we're also going to go in the shop and build some stands to, to put them because we we use the um, you know the deep supers to, to for, for our swarm traps and uh, so I need to have a stand to, um, to to set these on. I gathered all the our, our boxes are set over here. I think there's like 12 or 13 of them. Um, yeah, you can see all the bees. I don't know the camera showing, but some of them had honey in it, so the bees are robbing out. So Ralph and I get to work with the bees right now. And, uh, and then we'll get all the boxes cleaned up, loaded in the truck, and then we'll head out to the site after we construct the set, uh, our stands. So by the grace of God, by the end of the day, we ought to have at least 10 swarm traps set. Ralph brought two of his, so we'll set those. And we're probably hitting at least four different locations uh, setting our traps. So um, follow along as we uh, bait our traps, clean our boxes, build our stands, and set our traps. Let's do some uh, cleaning up, Ralph. Yes, sir. Look at this. So these these are robber bees in action. They're just going ahead and, and pulling the honey um, outside of the uh, um, from inside of the, the, the caps, and they're just digging it out. So Ralph's working on that honey box right now. Mm -hmm. That that hive it just died like last week, and uh, there were ten frames of, of honey right on top of it. So that sitting out there in the yard right now, getting robbed out. And these guys are right here robbing this one out. All right, so we got we got our um, ten boxes done, uh, ten inner covers, ten screen bottom boards, and they're all cleaned up, ready to go. So what we're going to do is we're going to assemble the boxes, throw them in the back of the truck. We're going to go inside the shop and we're going to make our, our stands that these boxes will be sitting on, and then we'll be out in the field. So we're going to pick this up inside the shop. Yeah, Ralph. Inside the shop. <laughs> Well, as you can see, I got my apron on, so that must mean I'm in the shop. 
Record Ralph and I have gone and, and cut off all our material to build um, our stands that our swarm traps are going to be sitting on. And uh, Ralph was over on the chop saw. He cut up all of our, our side bars that, that hold up the, this part. So this is what Ralph cut out. We cut out our tops and our bottoms. And then I've cut out the little support beams on the inside. So we're actually going to go ahead and uh, start assembling these things. we got a, uh, 10 of them to build. And uh, we're going to get these things done. You ready? I'm ready. Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, so we're going to do a top right now. We can do one of these stands right now. Ralph, Ralph's got an expert at this. The guy, the guy is a master in demolition and construction. <laughs> So we're going to finish these things up. Well, here's our finished product. We did 10 of them. Took us about an hour and a half. We got all, all our stuff loaded in, in the truck and we're headed up to the Beehive house to set some traps. So we're going to pick it up up there. So Ralph and I are up here at the, hunt, at the uh, Beehive house and uh, we've already set two of his traps uh, and I've already set two, two more of mine, but we're going to set the last one. And before we set them again, I'll show you uh, what, what's actually in the box. So, all the, the um, frames that Ralph and I had cleaned um, back at the shop, they're, they're in here. Um, we've got 10 frames in our, in our box. Not all of them have uh, drawn out comb. Some of them, some semi drawn out. But it's all, it's all, there's old brood comb in there. The box is all cleaned up. Our um, screen bottom boards all cleaned up, ready to go. So the last thing to do would um, be what am I going to put in it, the other attraction. So it's the smells that are in the box, the old brood comb. Um, that's really, uh, to me, I think that's the, the, the best attractant. But then the other thing is, is uh, the lemongrass oil. And I, I'm almost out of lemongrass oil, but uh, uh, I got a little, a few more drops in here. Let me grab my Q-tip and put some in here. What I do is take my, um, there's just a little few drops in here, but there's plenty enough. And uh, Normally I would just drop it on the uh, Q-tip, but since I'm at the end of it, we, we all got to just get it in there. All right, so we got enough on, on the end, and we're going to just put that inside of our box. In fact, I'm going to put the cap inside of there too. It's finished. May as well put the bottle too. Get all that smell in there. And uh, we're going to go ahead and, and uh, underneath the house, we've already got the stand set up, and we're going to put it up on there. So we'll watch what we do. I'm going to go ahead and try to set it up on that stand himself but I don't think he's going to be able to. Low ways up. <laughs> yeah, it's it's and that box does get heavy. In fact, last year I had to um get the uh stand uh, a little chair to put it to get that one down cuz I did catch a, a big swarm up there. Oh, uh, he's all muscle. Oh, he, wait, wait, we're going to help him. <laughs> there you go. We got it up there. We got it up there. All right, now the next thing we're going to do is we're going to put our strap on it. All right, we've got all of our traps set. And as you can see, I'm, I'm sitting right next to the top bar hive. It's still sitting out here at the beehive house. Um, and it is going to get up to the abbey within the next week. I just haven't um, done it yet. But uh, we've got these traps all set. And uh, like I, I told you before, the, the, what, what I've been doing uh, to, to catch these swarms, how we set our traps, um, putting them on, on our stands, but then what we're also placing inside them, the lemongrass oil, um, the old comb, and the old boxes. That, that to me is, is uh, the really key to uh, catching old swarms. But the real secret, I think, to catching swarms is, uh, is saying a blessing over them, asking for the graces that, that we actually catch bees. So before we close, we're going to do our blessing on our boxes, and, uh, and then we'll, we'll head on out here. So Father, thank you for uh, giving us this day to set these traps to catch uh, our bees. We ask that you bless this uh, effort that we've done so that when we catch all these bees, we continue to glorify you. And we make this prayer and all our prayers through your son, Jesus Christ. Amen. So, Ralph, you ready? 
Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching. Keep, Keep on, on watching. We'll, we'll be, be making, making more. more. God bless. God bless. Mr. Red and He's out. And Wreck It Ralph. We're out of here. We're out. <laughs> Good one, Ralph. He's <laughs> Good. <laughs>